Yo, 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 what is going on everyone? Thank you again for stopping by. My name is Dutch Line. And in this video, we are continuing with the Zen Garden. In the previous video, we got the second tutorial going for the game of Planet 2, where we are focusing on making a natural looking enclosure. The video was very well received. So I would like to thank you very much if you already checked the video out for checking the video out much appreciated thank you very much i will leave a link in this video uh, for that like previous one with the tutorial if you haven't seen it yet so feel free to check it out if you're not entirely sure on how to make a natural looking habitat it's a couple ideas and tips i think for um yeah like making one of these habitats so if you haven't checked it out please feel free to do so but in this video, we are continuing with the Sand Garden, which we started on two videos ago. So in the previous episode of this kind of series. We started with the, uh, the path system that leads in the middle of the area. It was quite difficult to be placed at the end of the day. I wanted to try to get the, uh, the three meter width path going instead of the four meter one. Because in the beginning, it seemed to be yeah, like way too big. At the end, though, we did get the four meter path in because the system for the uh, three meter path wasn't working at all unfortunately so yeah like we tried it it didn't work out so the four meter one is the way to go at the end though whenever it's all finished and like there it didn't seem too bad at the end so yeah like i guess it's a it's a good thing uh, that we still got a path going i do quite like the look of it now so yeah like again i think it's a uh, it, it's pretty decent like we're not gonna complain too much about it or at least i will not complain too much um but yeah again we're going to continue with the uh, the sand garden we're going to finish it in this video uh, where we're also going to start on another building that will be placed on the left side of the overall palace courtyard i think we can call it it's um the building that's going to be placed right next to the what's so called like an hotel kind of building the guests will not use it but it's more uh, yeah, like aesthetic wise and decoration going. Um, that also means that the building that we're going to create in this video, going to uh, yeah complete the whole left side of the courtyard. Whenever that's all done, uh, we're going to focus on the other side of the area, which we're going to be placing a greenhouse in and a shelter for the peafowls. Like all in all, whenever it's all finished, it is working quite well in real life. That is on uh, Twitch streams, of course. Also, once again, a good moment to mention that all the gameplay you see in YouTube videos have been created live over on Twitch. So if you haven't checked it out, I will leave a link in the description down below where we're building all these projects live. If you have some, like, some questions or yeah, like overall tips, maybe, uh, feel free to yeah, stop by in one of those streams and let me know what you think. We're also once again asking or answering that is uh, questions but also go over tutorials of like smaller things on how to do a specific task or uh, like how to build a specific object for example we also go over um, yeah like more general questions on habitats as well and how something is made again so once again feel free to uh, stop by in one of those streams i'll leave a link in the description down below um, but yeah, whenever the greenhouse and the shelter are finished, we're going to still work on the building that's already on the right side of the area. That's where the, uh, the staff room is placed. We also made that in one of the previous episodes as well. So that's already going. And whenever that is done, it is more yeah, like final decorations. Get like all the, uh, the normal things in, like uh, garbage bins, benches, like all the normal stuff kind of. Uh, that will also be focusing on one of the episodes as well and then we are pretty much ready whenever that's all finished on placing those peafowls in their new habitat that also means that we have to start to think on a new project so to speak a new enclosure or a new beginning so to speak because in the main gatehouse that leads towards the palace itself there's still like a big open area and i'm still to this day not entirely sure what to do with it so it's quite uh, yeah, it's quite difficult, so to speak. The piece of uh, foliage that we just deleted in that open spot, that is the area that we we're talking about, like this area. Like, it will be open. Uh, I was thinking of, yeah, like building a 
um, sort of a courtyard or an open-ish natural looking area. Like I'm not entirely sure. It's more ideas at this stage. So hopefully something will come up. If you do have an idea, then once again, please let me know. The comment section is open. I'll read every single comment. So if you do have an idea that sort of fits the scenery or overall aesthetic wise, then yeah, please let me know. Maybe we can do something with it and maybe even add it to the overall theme. Um, but yeah, for now, I think that is pretty much it for the commentary section of this video. So once again, thank you very much for tuning in. Much appreciated. Once again, we'll leave the link for the Twitch channel in the description down below. And for the tutorial video on the top right corner, that is, that will most likely be in the beginning of the video. Um, but yeah, for now, once again, thank you very much for tuning in. Much appreciated. Stay safe. I will see you later. Have a good one. Bye-bye.
Let's go, 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 let's go